Hey, this is your girl, Michelle Adiva, bringing you an episode of The Real Housewives of Dubai. Um, this is season two, episode one. Um, like, share, subscribe to my to my channel. Anyway, um, so the the episode begins with Ion, that's the, the model that looked like uh uh Iman. <laughs> um she telling her son some stupid knock knock joke in the back about a dinosaur coming up to a car. It was stupid. I was just like, okay, whatever. Her son, 17, he was like, yeah, whatever, mom. <laughs> um, Sarah is rock climbing with her son. And uh, she, uh, <laughs> and so the son said, mama, you thick. I said, Ooh, I don't think she liked that, you know. Anyway, Caroline B, because we have Caroline Brooks and Caroline Sands Stansberry. Okay, so Caroline B stands for black. <laughs> so she the black Caroline. <laughs> um, they are sage saging her new establishment. Um, cause she her her husband built her a high-end salon and she's saging her establishment and she don't want the, the uh, ashes in her in her wig per se. And Caroline Stansberry or the Caucasian Caroline um is doing a TikTok with her young husband Sergio. And she like I you know <laughs> I don't think I, I don't think this marriage is gonna last too long. <laughs> anyway, so Ayan goes over to Lisa's house. Um, nope. Ayan uh meets Lisa at Paddle Ball, but they could just, but they just call it Paddle. And it seems it seems like it's the same thing as pickleball here in the States. Where it's just a little bitty racket, um, and it's kind of like tennis, but they call it just paddle, whatever. And uh, Ayan can't even stretch right. Okay, that's how much she don't exercise. Okay, she was all wrong with the stretch. But um, so they have doubles, and uh, yeah. Ayan was just, <laughs> you could tell she, she couldn't, she, she was not into exercising at all. <laughs> this curtain don't even want, want to stay closed. Okay. Anyway, um, anyway, uh, so then Lisa was like, why are you wearing gloves? I'm not talking to you until you take your gloves off. <laughs> I said, okay. So Lisa wants to throw uh, the girls a brunch since they haven't been together since Beyonce um, threw her concert at, um, at Atlantis uh, Royale. Uh, I guess it's a new hotel. And, and so apparently... Lisa and Ayan was in the v VIP section where they met Kendall Jenner and uh, Beyonce's mom. Whatever. But the other girls were, in, were invited as well. But they weren't in the VIP section. I guess they were in the VIP section. No, they weren't in the v VIP section. I guess they were in the in the VIP section. I don't know. It is it's it's it seems so stupid to me. And they were like they were they were closer to the stage than Lisa and Ion were. Whatever. And then Sarah was like, I, I didn't even I didn't even go. <laughs> like whatever. But then Ion now Ion is all is over the top. We 
we we we get that from her. We, you know, we already assume she over the top, you know, she's a model, you know. But this confessional outfit where she had red roses on top of her head and on on the dress and all that other stuff looked a hot ass mess, okay? Hot ass mess. I you know, I, I'm with her, you know, when she over the top, but she was way, way over the top. <laughs> I wasn't with her with this with this outfit. So who Lord? So the the Caucasian Caroline <laughs> and her new new uh newlywed husband, Sergio, is um getting a house built. And apparently it's taking way too long to build the house. And they said, she said, you know, we've been married for uh, uh, close to a year. And uh, she said, you know, so the the sex is getting less. And she said, I, I, I like that. I said, oh, okay. And, um, <laughs> and but he, he still, he's still clingy. And, and he, I mean, he, it seems like he works with the ground. She walk on. She like, you know, she can do with or without him, basically. I, mm, I don't know if they're going to last too long. And then he want to have a baby. And she says she's 46, 47 years old. And, you know, she got one embryo, a boy, that's on ice for whenever it comes a time. Um, you 46, 47, you might need to have more embryos if you, you feel like, you know, you want, you really want to have a baby. And if you don't want to have a baby, then you need to get a surrogate to get that one embryo because I think you need some multiples just in case that one don't tank. But I like I said, I don't I don't see a future with them because she is she she already looks like she's sick of him. Anyway, Caroline B, as in black. She like I said, she got a high end salon. Her husband is the contractor. So she ain't spent too too much money on uh getting it um established so quickly because she said in the confessionals that you know she she spent a whole lot of money to get it uh uh quickly done but i don't think she spent that much money because her husband is the contractor or ex-husband i'm sorry ex-husband her baby daddy anyway sarah's doing spiritual healing some shaman, some kind of stuff. Because she's trying to start a new relationship. She's trying to start a relationship. And, um, and, <laughs> but she needs to get over her old relationships first. <laughs> this little, this little, Curtin don't want to don't want to do right. Anyway, so she she, she got to get over her old relationships first <laughs> to get to get a new one. Okay, so and she had two two failed marriages, not one, but so Lisa taking her son to soccer practice. That both of both her kids playing soccer. Uh Caroline Stansberry. Um, meets with um, Ayan. Um, Ayan um, brought a pineapple. She says she prickly on the outside, and uh, she is uh, sweet on the inside. I was like, 
I ain't always bringing some crazy gifts to people. She get she brought uh, what's her name a gift? She brought um, Lisa a goat. <laughs> kind of messes that. But they both have kids going to college, and they're and both their kids want to go to college in America. And they don't want them to go to college in America because they say it's unsafe. I can't blame them. I don't know how safe it is in Dubai, but I can't blame them for not wanting her, their kids to come to America and um, and them, them not be safe in America. I can't blame them. <laughs> I'm not mad with that. <laughs> Ion said she had a problem with Sarah because apparently... Um, Sarah, um, last season, Sarah got her to open up to a therapist about her, her upbringing in Africa and, and she broke out crying and, you know, talking about her grandmama, her auntie tied her, tied when she was five, tied her down to the bed and all that other stuff. And it, 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 it seemed like it was very traumatic to her. And, uh, but, uh, Sarah went online and went to social media saying that, um, she, uh, <laughs> she's playing victim. That's terrible. <laughs> she playing victim. <laughs> anyway, um, so then Ion said that she went to Africa and she found out that her mama wasn't like 65 like she thought she would. She was in her 80s. I don't know how you get that mixed up or whatever. But she said, so Ayan said, I may be older than <laughs> what I think I am. She said, I may be older than you. I, th I think so. <laughs> so apparently... Season one, she clowned uh, Caroline about her age uh, numerous times. So, I guess she getting her leg back. <laughs> so, uh, the new girl, Talene, um, is Caroline B's friend. And um, apparently, they she knew her for a decade or whatever. Celine moved to L.A. when she was 17, um, and uh, she started her music career. Um, she performed with Jamie Foxx, Sting, and Christina Aguilera. She was name-dropping all everybody. And then she met the love of her life, and then they moved to Dubai. And so she had no friends over here, but Caroline, she met Caroline and they've been friends ever since. Apparently, uh, Talene was uh, very intoxicated at Beyonce's concert and she uh, took, a, took a spill. <laughs> and I guess all her legs and stuff went up and, you know, and Caroline Stansberry, um, uh, said um, that um, she was, you know, what kind of people you bringing in this group to Caroline B. Uh, I mean, she liked to have a good time. I don't see the, I don't see the problem with it. She, she was into to uh, intoxicated. I mean, I'm quite sure you, when you get intoxicated, you may fall too. I mean, I don't see, I don't see what the problem is. But it is what it is. Um, Lisa and uh, Ayan show up to the brunch first. Ayan got these heels on that she can't even walk. <laughs> she can't even walk, okay? And definitely she can't walk in sand. And um, then Caroline S. shows up next. Um, <laughs> so, but... When Caroline um, was getting out the car, Sergio was like, call me if you need me. 
And she was like, I'm not going off to war. And he was like, well, it can be war. <laughs> Sergio cracked me up. I, I feel so bad for Sergio because, you know, she 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 really ain't into him like he want, want her to be. Uh, I um, want Caroline and Lisa to be friends. So they can they can be a little threesome, and and she said y'all got um, things in common like shopping and Birkins. <laughs> I, I guess that's that's the only. <laughs> I guess they can build up a friendship over that. I guess I don't know. Uh so then Caroline B. Sarah and Celine show up all together. Um, yeah, so then, so I um, <laughs> told Celine, I heard you fail <laughs> and showed, it showed your ass in, in your vajayjay. <laughs> I said, okay. I said, I guess you ain't gonna warm up or nothing. <laughs> and so Celine was like, you know, she said, you know, I, I had I had a good time. But then she said, what she said, I can get a little assy. <laughs> but <laughs> most of the time, I'm classy. I said, okay, girl. I like you already. <laughs> I can get a little assy. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but most of the time, I'm classy. Okay. But apparently, she she denied that people saw her for JJ. Uh, uh, Caroline S. said that, you know, Sergio, her husband, seeing her for JJ, but he could have, he could have been mistaken too. Um, let me see, let me see, let me see. Um, so then Ion confronts Sarah about her playing victim. And so she said, your story is not, uh, oh, she said, she said, I didn't say you were playing victim. She said, but um, your story is not ex an excuse to be mean to people. So I guess she, she was mean to people back on season one. And uh, she said, because she, she, She's been through a lot in her life, I guess. I don't know. Uh, but so they go back and forth arguing, Ayan and Sarah. And Caroline S. was like, listen, stop it. I want to enjoy my bread. So can y'all take that over there? I said, oh, mm -mm. no, she didn't. She said, I want to enjoy my bread. That's right. Enjoy your food. And you ain't got time for no arguments. You better enjoy your food. <laughs> I laugh so hard. Yeah, so she said, can you take that over there? And y'all talk by yourselves because I'm, I'm trying to enjoy my bread, okay? Be tripping and stuff. So, um, then Telling asked Caroline, are we good? <laughs> and so, Caroline was like, yeah, well, I don't see what the problem is. And she was like, well, you know, it seemed like, um, how you told, um, Caroline B, how you talked to Caroline B, um, you were saying like, um, who behaves like this and who who did you bring into this group and stuff like that. And then <laughs> Caroline S. was like, did I say that? And Caroline B. was like, uh, yes, you did. <laughs> so that, that's, that's, that's going to be a cause of friction between Caroline's and the Caroline's, okay? Because... <laughs> Cause she was just like, yeah, that that that's what it, that's what it was. So, um, yeah. So this was the first episode. Uh, you know, 
I don't think I got through the first season, though. I think I was kind of bored with it. So we're going to see if, you know, what this season holds, okay? So, yeah. So anyway, like, share, subscribe, give me a thumbs up. And, um, damn, that's it. <laughs> Share, subscribe, <laughs> give me a thumbs up, get down in the comments. It, it, did anybody get through uh season one? Because I don't, I didn't get, I don't think I got through season one um of Dubai. But did anybody else get through season one? Did anybody enjoy it? Let me know. All right, so this is your girl, Miss Yellow Diva, signing off. Peace.